IMSTA Weather Plus forecast with Chief Meteorologist Tom Tasselmeyer. Well, we had a little bit of cloud cover move through the area late last night, early this morning, especially south of Baltimore and across the lower eastern shore. But other than that, it's really pretty much been a continuation of this uh, weather pattern that has produced clear, cool nights and sunny, warm days. You can see the last of the clouds moving off the coast around Ocean City earlier this uh, morning and exiting stage right, leaving behind, well, all out sunshine for most of the state and another warm afternoon. From 80 in Frostburg and 83 in Hagerstown to about 85 or so over at Ridgely in Caroline County and Chestertown and Elkton as well. Eastern Shore kind of warm this afternoon. Low 80s down into southern Maryland. A bit cooler on the coast at Ocean City or up in the high mountains out in western Maryland. Closer to home in Baltimore, we've got 82 now in downtown Baltimore, 82 in Cockeysville, and a warm 86 degrees over in Howard County around Columbia. But those temperatures will cool rapidly again tonight because the air is still dry, the wind's calm, and the sky's clear. And that's the scenario that sends us downward by about 30 degrees for most areas. 54, 55 or so in the outlying suburbs, 64 in downtown Baltimore. Sunset this evening at 712. So we've been watching this big blue H slowly move through the mid-Atlantic. It's nearly stationary now, barely budging. It will gradually weaken and drift off the coast, though, allowing the next front to make its approach. And that brings us at least a chance, but it's a minimal chance for showers over the upcoming weekend. Maybe if this front stalls just south of us, like we think it may, then the, the rain chances will go up a little bit on Monday and Tuesday of next week. But overall, this is still basically in control of our weather, and it's blocking what looks to be an area of low pressure trying to form in the Gulf of Mexico. Hurricane Center is keeping a close eye on this. It's producing numerous showers, as you can see, across Florida. And it may try to become a tropical system over the next 48 hours or so, something to keep an eye on. But in the meantime, that high pressure cell remains in control of our weather. So another sunny day tomorrow, and even Saturday, I think, while we may see a few clouds, it may be a little more humid, a mostly sunny Saturday. And uh, we'll see that line of showers associated with the front getting into western Pennsylvania, maybe western Maryland late in the afternoon going into the evening, a chance for a shower or clap of thunder out there. But watch the way the front weakens, crosses the mountains, and really just kind of pushes through our area mostly dry. We'll hold on to a slight 20% chance of a shower here Sunday afternoon, but it's looking like that may even fall apart. Tomorrow, 81 to 86, just like today. Mostly sunny skies, south winds 3 to 8, sunrise 649. Friday on the bay, the winds will still be light and the waves only around a foot or so. Water temperatures upper 70s to nearly 80 degrees in most locations. In the mountains, if that's your destination for Friday and the weekend, it'll be pretty nice. 75 tomorrow, a few clouds Saturday, Saturday night, Sunday morning, maybe a shower, and then more sunshine Sunday afternoon. So another good weekend out in the Mar Western Maryland mountains. Eastern shore, warm temperatures, sunny skies. Coastal areas around Ocean City, a few clouds, but mostly sunny, and high temperatures around 80 degrees. The tropical Atlantic, still a little active, but what was once a tropical depression looking like it might develop is still just a tropical depression with 30 mile an hour winds and actually weakening a bit should drift toward the central Atlantic and cause uh, no problems really for most folks. Seven day forecast then sunny and warm Friday and Saturday, a 20% chance of a brief shower Sunday afternoon. Again, if that front stalls, uh, then the chances go up to about 30% for some rain on Monday and Tuesday. Fall begins on Wednesday with a high of 76 degrees.